I'm very, very disappointed. Senator T.G. Gingona fumes at Justice Agreed. Secretary Leila First Delima. Time. The chairman of the Blue Ribbon Committee expected principal whistleblower Senate Ben Hurlui and other former Senate. aides of mastermind Janet Napoles to appear in the hearing Tuesday after a commitment from Delima last week. But Delima changes her mind. But after our conversation, um, Your Honor, I, I had to take a closer look at the law particularly the Ombudsman Law and uh, the um Ombudsman Rules of Procedure. And it was confirmed from my reading of the law that actually whenever a case has been filed with the Ombudsman, the general rule becomes no publicity if it will prejudice the disposition of a case this hearing is suspended. Thank you. The hearing abruptly ends. Gingona orders the Lima to bring the whistleblowers to the next hearing on Thursday. The no, senator no, says no. Senate President Franklin Drilon and the Lima are wrong in invoking the Ombudsman rules. Nobody, nobody, the Ombudsman nor the courts can interfere with the Senate. We are a separate branch of government. And this has been these powers have been put in the Constitution and upheld in a long line of cases of the Supreme Court. And I will not allow anyone, anyone, to diminish the power and the stature of the Senate. But Gingona is in for more disappointment. While Drilon signs the subpoena for the Lima and the whistleblowers, the Senate President announces the Senate will abide by the advice of Ombudsman Conchita Carpio Morales not to summon Napolis to its investigation. Drilon sought her opinion after Gingona asked him to sign a subpoena for Napolis. Out of prudence and out of respect for her office, we must defer to the judgment of the Ombudsman as she has acquired primary jurisdiction over the case. Gingona again cries foul. He says it doesn't make sense that Drilon summons the whistleblowers but refuses to subpoena the alleged pork barrel queen. The chairman adds the Senate is not bound by the advice of the Ombudsman. Senator Francis Escudero agrees. Nabasa ko ang letter ng Ombudsman. Wala sa kanyang poder na sabihin kung ano ang in aid of legislation at ano ang hindi. Wala rin sa kanyang poder na sabihin kung ano ang maaaring sabihin ni Napoles dahil desisyon lamang ni Napoles yun at maraming. Escudero says the senators will meet to resolve the fate of the Senate's probe into its own members. The independence of the Senate or the authority of the Ombudsman. Beyond the legal debate, a power struggle ensues among the President's own allies in the Senate as more names get dragged into the pork barrel scam. They all claim to uphold the law and the public good, but whose interests are they really protecting? Ayu Makaraig, Rappler.